brawlers. Grandpa's got a brand new back of gun. So, you chicken? Ah, another lackey of masquerades. Yeah, this is starting to get old. But just for fun, let me show you who's boss. No way! I call dibs on this creep! Hey! No fair! Dan, wait! Field open! Come on, Drago! Defense! Ah. Must resist! You just got lucky, that's all! I'll be back, you freak! So, I'm guessing you beat him? Way to go, Dan! I had total confidence you could do it! Ah, it was nothing. <laughs> I had him on the ropes! <laughs> Dan, no! Are you okay, What's Dan? Wrong, Dan? Can you hear me? Come on, Dan. Man, that was way up there on the freaky scale. I remember I beat the dude, but after that, it's a total blank. Oh, that was so hilarious, Dan. The way that wannabe brawler ran with his tail between his legs. Well, it is kind of your own fault, Mr. Berinsky. I knew this would turn into a snooze fest. I'm just lucky that Drago was tough enough to take that jump out when he did. According to my data, they will face much stronger opponents. I might suggest our strategy should reflect this in any future battles. In English? Meaning that a Bakugan is at its peak when all of its six attributes are in perfect alignment. Dan's Bakugan is Drago, and it's a Pyrus, a fire attribute. Yours is a Chaos, a light attribute. And my Prius is classified as an Aquas. That's water. But the problem is combined, we don't have enough attributes to fight at full power. Add on Julie's, which is Subterra, the Earth attribute. That means we're too short. Darkest with its darkness attribute, and the wind, Ventus. Hey, guess who has Ventus? Sean! Correct, Dan. Right now, Masquerade is stronger than us. I suggest we align ourselves with Shun to increase our power and defeat Masquerade. Brilliant! With Shun on our team, we'll be a force to be reckoned with. No one will even come close to beating us. Not to mention, Shun's a real hunk. Right, Dan? This is the most impeccable proposal I believe we've ever engineered. What do you think, Dan? No! Huh? But, Dan, we need all the help we can get. Or maybe you're jealous. I am not. Besides, I don't need any help from him or anybody else, including you, Rono. You got that? Yep, you're jealous. Girls, who needs them? Boy, if Dan finds out what we're doing, he's going to be so mad. Relax, Marucho. We have to ask Jun to help us. And trust me, Dan will thank us. I hope so. I wonder why Dan is so dead set against Shun. I remember they used to be the best of buds. They were even the ones who came up with all the Bakugan rules. Wow, that's almost interesting. Call me crazy, but I thought for sure Dan would want to hook up with Shun again. Look, Runo, I believe that's Shun's house down there. What? According to my research, Shun's family owns the largest estate west of Bay City. Big bucks and good looks? Hello, Shun. Uh, Runo, we're here on business. Besides, what if Shun decides he's not interested in joining us? Our whole mission would be a failure, and worse, we could lose our Bakugan! Quit being such a worry ward. Now, let's get this over with. Hey, Shun! That was fast. <gasps> I wouldn't want to be the one who has to vacuum this place. You think anyone's at home? No clue. But let's keep looking. This place reminds me of your house, Marucho. One big oversized mansion with never enough bathrooms. <laughs> oh no, what did I do? Big boo! 
booby trap. You can say that again. <laughs> well, what have we here? A couple of snoopy little kids who have the gall to break into my house. If you two little whippersnappers think you're smarter than me, then you've got another thing coming. Yeah. You got any clue in the old dude in the sweatpants? That's Shun's grandfather who used to be a famous ninja warrior back when there used to be ninja warriors. You're kidding. State your business here, or prepare to face my wooden stick. Please, put down the stick. We come in peace. Yeah, we're friends of your grandson, Shun. We just want to see him. My grandson? You say you're friends? My name is Runo, and this is Marucho. Hey, what are you doing? Trying to give me a wedgie or something? Hmm. See? Show this to Shun, and he'll explain everything to you. No, please! <laughs> what did I ever do to you? <laughs> oh. Ah. <laughs> hmm. Oh, yes. You're what they call Bakugan brawlers. I know all about you. And you're here to get Shun to play this silly game again. Well, yeah, that's kind of what we were thinking. That's what I thought. He's not interested. Now leave the premises at once, intruders. Please, please, please. Can we just see him for five minutes, please? You're starting to get on my nerves, kid. Now beat it. This isn't working, but I've got an idea. Okay, Grandpa. If you refuse to bring Shun to us, we'll just go find him ourselves then. Yeah, and just one thing. You mind giving me back my Bakugan? Sure, what do I care? Not again! <laughs> Don't you hear me? Guys, want a battle? Are you nuts? <laughs> Wait a minute. I've got an idea. You stop time when Shun's grandpa was about to attack. All we have to do is find the exact spot where we were standing. Oh, I think I caught your draft. Let's do it. I do believe we were standing right about here. Okay, we'll just move over here. Are you ready? You got it. Field close. <laughs> She's gonna leave a mark! Oh, oh. <laughs> oh honey bun, did you put the cat out? We found you. I was beginning to get a little worried back there. It's so nice to see you again. Why did you come here? We know it's short notice, Shun, but we kind of need your help. I don't know if you know this, but there's this really freaky dude who calls himself Masquerade, and he's been, well, sending kids back gone to the Doom Dimension forever. Yeah, we have to stop him. He's challenged us to a battle, and before we agree, we need you and your Bakugan to boost our power. Without you, we all could lose our Bakugan. So what do you say, Shun? You in or out? Well? Well? Sorry, I don't play on a team. Huh? Now leave. Huh? Bakugan Battle Brawlers will be right back. Back to Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Now what? Shun, open up! <laughs> Didn't I tell you, kids? My grandson doesn't want anything to do with you two. Now skedaddle before I get all ninja on you. <laughs> oh, man. This old creep's giving me the creeps. Come on, Shun! Please, Shun, open up! If you don't, then all the Bakugan rules that you and Dan created will be destroyed forever. You gotta let us in. At least let us take you on in a battle. Sean! Are you sure you want them to leave, Shun? If they do, I don't think they'll ever come back again. They came a long way just to talk to you. Yeah. 
Oh, Shun. It's okay, Skyrus. If you're worried about me, don't. Everything will be fine. You must stop running away from what's in your heart. After all, there will come a day when you will have to face up to it. And this just may be that time. Dan blows us off, and then Shun doesn't want anything to do with us. If there's one thing I'll never figure out, it's boys. Hey, Runo, think we should go back and try again? <gasps> Shun? Did you change your mind and decide to join up with us? But only if you can defeat me. Sounds like a blast. I'm up for it. No, let me, Runo. I have a better chance pitting my Aquas against his Ventus. You gotta trust me on this one. I'm ready when you're ready. Huh? I'll take you both on. You can't be serious. Yes, feel! Open! Open. He doesn't know what he's doing. He's crazy. Two against one. He doesn't stand a chance. Gate car! Set! Okay, I'll go first. Back of guard, bro! Terror claw, stand! Falconeer, stand! G's. But that's not enough G's, and that's exactly what he's thinking. All I have to do is throw down my Sora's character card and double my power. Falconeer, three, two, zero G's. He didn't attack us. We've got to be careful and come up with a plan, Marucho. I got it. You know, as crazy as it sounds, it just might work. Okay, Lemulus, game on! Back to God, bro! Lemulus, stand! Lemulus has now entered the battle. No other data available. We're looking good, Marucho. Now time for phase two. You got it! Ability card activate! <laughs> Holograph divide! With this defense shield, Lemulus' power will increase as the battle intensifies. That's because he'll absorb the power used against him. And that makes our plan virtually unbeatable. This is so cool. Oh, yeah. Falconer 2 has now entered the battle. Didn't see that coming. Back to the drawing board. Well, looks like my turn. What? What are you saying, Tigrera? Shun's Bakugan are on the verge of attacking. I know their moves. Trust me. Atta boy, Tigrera. You get in there and show them who's boss. This just might work. Let's do it. Okay, Tigrera, we're all counting on you. Gate card set! <coughs> Introducing new player. Bakugan Bra! <coughs> Tigrera, stand! If I need you, are you there, Skyrus? Yes. This is it! Bakugan Bra! Skyrus, stand! <coughs> Fury! 
power decrease by one zero zero Gs. Plump lady sings. Yeah. You mean we still have a chance? Now we know his move. We can counter him and beat him. Yeah, what he said. We need a surprise attack. We need you, Prius. You're our last hope. <laughs> Back again. No! Prius, stand. I heard there was a little soiree happening, and I thought I would just pop in and play. Shall we begin? Well, what do I do? Prius at three zero zero G's. Falconeer remains stable at three two zero G's. This doesn't look good. Don't worry, Marucho. I've got it figured out. You sure you know what you're doing? I have to get Tigrera into the battle to help Prius. Bruno, once a Bakugan loses in battle, the rules clearly state you can't use it again. Yeah, but I think I found a loophole. Just leave it to me, okay? But here's what you can do. You keep Shun Skyrest busy with Prius. Yeah, sure. Are you ready? Huh? Gate card, open! Positive Delta! You've got to be kidding! Oh, crud. Change of attribute! Darkness! <laughs> what? Attribute change? No way! Typhoon power reduction to one, two, zero Gs. But how? This is so cool. Shun's positive delta steals power away from water, light, and fire attributes. But when it's attacked by wind, earth, and darkness, it works in reverse. In other words, my Prius is sapping Shun's typhoon dry. Oh, yeah. That's because Prius changed his attribute. Way to go, Prius. That was sweet. Yep, that's a dirty job, but somebody's got to do it. All right. Incoming! So... There is a Bakugan who can change his own attribute. Skyrus enters battle. Whoa. Okay, Griffin. Bakugan, crawl! Ability card activate! Venomous Beast Torrent attack! Whoa. Thank you for giving me a second chance. I didn't realize you could morph your Bakugan. That's how you got Tigrera into the battle again. Uh, let's talk about that later, Maricho. We still have one more battle to win. Bakugan, roll! Grant, stand! Ability card activate! Wind and water combined! Ability card activate! Savage X! Gate card open! Skyrus, let's lock and load. Accessing strength. Skyrus power surge to 720Gs. Prius increase to 400Gs. Tigrera to 340Gs. And once you add that up, we're at 740Gs. We are the champions. We are the champions. Let's finish this. Shun! Don't worry, Skyrus. I still haven't played my ace yet. Ability card activate! Firestorm! Skyrus power increase detected. Combined reading at 920 Gs. Ah, we're in trouble. Game over. You lose our bet. Uh, but... Oh, no! Hey, this is Dan. 
Coming up on Bakugan, I find out Masquerade is ranked number one, while Shun is dropped down to sixth. And Shun is one unhappy camp. Then he finds out his mother is sick, so he decides to quit playing Bakugan. But I've got a sneaky little plan to get him back into the game. Trust me, this one's gonna be a real Wild West showdown, and you'll have to watch to see who wins. Hey, be there. Bakugan, brawl! <laughs>